Assalamu alaikum everyone and welcome you are at IBBC 2024. My name is Pinish Sandhu and I am going to present my research work which is undergone by the supervision of Ms. Laiba Said and Dr. Rubia. And today is my presentation talk which is Combined Effect of Question and Alpha Lipoic Acid on Kidney in Diabetic Mice. Motivation behind this topic that why I choose this topic, the most common metabolic disorder, risk, risk for other diseases, a burden on health sector. Diabetes mellitus is usually known as high sugar level in the blood, which causes the narrowing of blood vessels, increase the heart disease. Diabetes may lead to chronic kidney disease. In world ranking, it is 10.5%. In Pakistan, diabetic rate is 30.8 percent. The com two compounds which are used for the treatment of diabetic mellitus are quercetin and alpha lipoic acid. Quercetin, a plant pigment, is antioxidant flavonoid. It is versatile antioxidant known to possess protective abilities against tissue injury induced by inflammation and hyperglycemia. Alpha lipoic acid is also an antioxidant used to treat chronic diseases associated with oxidative stress such as diabetic kidney disease. Here are the two figures of kidneys. First one is normal kidney and the second is diabetic kidney. In normal kidney, nephrons are working properly. While in diabetic kidney, the leakage of protein occur in the urine due to the diabetic effect. Research objectives. The, the study's primary goal given as follows. To investigate the diabetic effect on kidney is mice induced by loxin. To evaluate the combined effect of quercetin and alpha lipoic acid in treatment of diabetes mellitus. Problem statement. Diabetes mellitus is a chronic metabolic disease and growing rapidly in Pakistan and effect on different organs including kidney so it is important to understand the effect of diabetes mellitus. Hypothesis question and alpha lipoic acid in combination might be helpful in treating diabetes mellitus. Significance of the study. Current study will benefit our society for identification and lowering the risk related to diabetic effect. It will also provide better understanding on synergistic effect of antioxidant that is alpha lipoic acid and question against metabolic disorder that is diabetes mellitus. This will further provide a natural alternate of pharmaceutical medicine for treatment of diabetes mellitus. In the methodology of this research work was carried out in animal house and sampling were done on adult male albino mice at research laboratory and animal house of Punjab University. 40 animals are randomly divided into 8 groups. Each group contains 5 mice. In first group it is control group. In second group uh, it is a CMC group. Third group is question group, fourth group is alpha lipoic acid group, and other four groups are induction uh, of loxins in the uh, in the mice, which is caused by the which caused the diabetes mellitus. Sampling and laboratory analysis. Animals were dissected after collecting blood samples. Serum separation by centrifugation at 3000 RPM and stored at minus 20 degrees centigrade. Biochemical analysis for sodium, potassium, urea, creatinine and their data analysis occurred. In results, before treatment and after treatment, their body weight are visualized on daily basis and recorded weight gain in control and treatment groups
blood le blood glucose level before treatment and after treatment are noted and calculated on daily basis renal parameters of the albuminous when visualize their urea and creatinine level the rise due to the high increased sugar level increased plasma level were observed serum blood urea nitrogen were, was excreted through renal glomerulus via blood transportation increased creatinine level is a sign of nephron damage as creatinine is a breakdown product of creatinine phosphate and filtered via kidneys decrease creatinine excretion show loss of kidney glomerular function alpha lipoic acid in question decrease the thickening of glomerular basement membrane and recover the damage potassium level decrease and sodium level increase in diabetic group due to the high sugar levels and effect on kidney their electrolytes are imbalanced when they are treated with alpha lipoic acid and questing they begin to normal as close to control and their electrolyte balance and acid base balance are maintained conclusion in this work we compared and contrast the effect of alpha lipoic acid in question groups with control and diabetic group the protective potential of alpha lipoic acid in question on the kidney of albino has shows healing properties alpha lipoic acid in question were tested alone or in combination to determine antioxidative potential of both these compounds thank you